Here's a YouTube video that says, Be very careful when buying gold and silver. I totally agree with that. You've got to be careful. But gold has been treating me very nicely in this bug demic. Now, I don't have physical gold. You know, coins or bars. I don't have any physical silver. What I have is gold mutual funds, which are basically mining stock funds. But nevertheless, these mining stock funds parallel the price of physical gold. So I don't have to own any physical gold, store it. I have the mutual fund gold. And I can buy it and sell it very quickly in one day. Physical gold, I can't sell that in one day. It's a problem right now even selling it. But today, if I want to sell some of my gold mutual funds, I can press a button and get rid of it today or buy more. But right now, I am happy with it. As I said before, I do not buy on speculation. I do not buy where I think the market is going to go up. I'll never buy on speculation. That's how losers buy in the stock market. I only buy on facts or sell on facts. The fact is, it's either going up or going down over a certain period of time that I'll buy, buy it or I'll sell it. And so far, the last uh, four or five months, gold has been moving up. So as it moved up, I bought some, moved up some more in a period of time, bought some more, then waited, it moved up again, bought some more. Right now, I have a very good gold mutual fund holding. I don't like to have it a lot, but it's balanced off with everything else. But the good news is, gold mutual fund is moving up where stocks are going sideways, are moving down. Right now, I've got uh, gold mutual funds that in one day, because of the fear in this bugdemic, moved up 10% in one day. Normal investors are happy if they can get a 10% return on their investment in a year. I got it in one day. So as this message here says, be very careful when buying gold and silver. Yes, be very careful. Don't throw all of your money into it all at once. Just move into it slowly. If it goes down and it looks like it's trending down, then get out of it. But keep some so you can keep track of it. But so far, I'm very happy with the performance of the gold mutual funds. They're making money where none of my other uh, holdings are making anything are holding steady.